back in the day, back in elementary school, you don't really think of it as volunteering and giving back. You just think it, you know, it's a fun way. You're getting involved. You're meeting new people. You know, a little bake sale here and there. It doesn't seem like a lot. One day you wake up and it's like, wow, what we do here, all this extra hours we put in, volunteer time, like it really does make a difference. Some of the moments that were defining for me as to like why I do this and where you really see the value uh, of what you're doing, giving back. One example is the, uh, the Quebec Breast Cancer Foundation Run for the Cure. You know, it's, uh, it's like 10.45, we're on stage, the run has just begun, the, the 1K walk, and you see thousands of people going by with tears in their eyes. It's an, it was such an emotional build-up to get to that moment, and you brought all these people from the, from the community together, those who have suffered great loss, and those who are, you know, fighting the battle of cancer and, and winning. Those are the moments that really make it worth it. You know, I have the, the two-year plan and the five-year plan and the 30-year plan. Not quite as figured out yet. We're going to see where the wind takes us. But uh, I just, I mean, I love Montreal. And if I could still be in this city, that would be amazing. You know, I, I never want to leave. Um, I'm hoping to just keep on doing what I'm doing, giving back to the community. I, I really, it's something that I enjoy to the, you know, to the bottom of my heart. And uh, if I can still be doing this happily in 30 years, and that, that sounds good to me.